the bar, off the bar, off the bar, off the bar. I'm too persistent. Whip in comment, no cash. Get it on my own, no collab. Hey, if I'm not mistaken, we've got Andy Panda Django here, bro. Now, the person's name that requested this is in Russian, so I don't know exactly how to pronounce it, but apparently this is one of his, like, first videos. And I don't even know how to verify if it's actually the song's called Django, because as you can see, the title's in Russian as well. But hopefully I got the right video. And um, apparently this is he's very young here, and this is, like, his first video or whatever. So, yeah, let's get into it. Let's see what I got. When was this? Well, this says three years ago, but, yeah, it must be... More than that, it's more than three years ago. Yeah, he didn't even have a beard here, blood. Here, normally, every single time I see Andy Panda, he has his beard and that, bro. You know, and he didn't even have his beard here. That's crazy. Obviously the lyrics mean absolutely nothing to me because I don't speak Russian. Wait, let me try something. Can I turn on see you can't even turn on the captions, bro. You know, and I thought the captions might have translated it. But um what was I even gonna say? Oh yeah, the voice as well, but there's a big difference is the voice. Obviously, you can still kind of hear a deepness, bro, but his voice wasn't as mature. So I feel like he still knew how to utilize his voice to even make it sound as deep as it is right now, bro. But he still wasn't at his like, full potential, bro. He didn't fully sound like a man yet, man. You know what I mean? He was still developing. <laughs> Selection. And this is what I was saying when I reacted to Miyagi and Andy Panda's Hajime video. You can go check that one out. Um, and I was saying that back in the younger days, it seemed like all they were concentrating on was hip hop, bro. Just rapping the heart out, and that, and that shows it once again here, bro. You know what I mean? With the way that he's rapping and them thing down, it's just bar after bar after bar. I can hear the word selection, and he's choosing certain words and using the same rhyming word in the same sentence, and that to make it sound nice, so it flows very well. That's where you get a bit more technical with it, bro. But yeah, man, man likes that. I like that right there. <laughs> I could be wrong, but it sounded like he didn't say petition, but the word that he said sounded like petition and document. But I don't know if that's what he was actually saying, and that it's just words that sound similar to him. <laughs> So, because I was literally seeing like the letter three right there, bro. You know what I mean? So, let me know what letter that represents. Because obviously, I see the E right here. So, surely this three must mean something else. So, if that's just the way he's writing it. But let me know what this three represents in the Russian language. <laughs> Yeah, this one's simple, man. This one's simple because I'm not really used to tracks like this from Miyagi and Andy Panda in terms of just a verse, hook, verse, hook, verse, song finish. Normally, they're way more artistic with it and that, but I guess it also shows how like they developed as artists as well, man. You know, and in terms of the great artists that they've come and adapted.
adapting so many different sounds and just developing the sound to where they can like flow on the tracks differently and use melodic certain I mean use melodic tones and certain breaks in certain places and how they can break down a song and manipulate a song and all of them things there man you know and but yeah it's still nice though because this is like just the essence and that when these guys were hungry for it so you just yeah they just got that rapper rapper kind of vibe <laughs> Still utilizing the voice and the cadence. Obviously, I've been hearing the, the Rasta man, but did you just say a Barack Obama? Yeah, I think he did. I think he did, bro. You know, and I think he's a Barack Obama. Bro. Shout out to him. So marijuana. Mm. Man, that's what I'm saying. Word selection, and he's using words that sound similar to each other. Because I think he said "badder than man," like you're not badder than me, type of thing. You know, and I'm just guessing here. I'm just guessing. That's marijuana. Yeah, shout out to Andy Panda, man. He was really, really young here. And he was still showing talent as well, man. You know, and even though he was that young. I'm tired, man. Shout out to Andy Pan. Oh, you can see the beard going in still. You might have even shared from, you never know. But yeah, shout out to Miyagi. Shout out to the person that requested his apologies that I can't say your name because obviously I can't say it in Russian and that. But um, yeah, hopefully you guys enjoyed. It's been your boy and Jazz and I'm out of here and a bit people, man. I'm gone.